All right, everybody, how's it going? Welcome to the demo for Born Punk, which, as you can see, is a pixel art style cyberpunk point and click adventure game. And from this alone, it looks absolutely brilliant. I can't wait to see what this is about. Let's jump in with a new game. We'll do start game and we'll see. Here we go. Born Punk Steam demo. Here we go. Right. We are ready. Assets, voices, and gameplay are not final and subject to change. Fair enough, as it is a demo. This looks really cool, though. I love this text scroll in the top right-hand corner. It's definitely got that cyberpunk feel to it so far. Next email. Recipient. Jonathan Exley. CEO, Mitsutomo International. Regarding resignation that... What? Ooh. What's going on here? Transfer complete. Assessing situation. That was weird. Surrounded by biological life form. Database corrupted. What? What is this voice? I can't control my body. What is happening? Host is interfering with rescue operation. Suppression initiated. Suppression? Give me back my body! Demon! Issue! Security! Host suppressed. Diversion protocol initiated. This is wild! <laughs> ma'am, McCain reporting for duty. What seems to be the problem, ma'am? Nothing, guard. I... Joy... Don't... Li I am sorry, guard. It has been a stressful day. Are you sure, Miss Sotomayor? Something doesn't seem orderly here. Definitely not. Are you under any sort of duress? No, really. Joe E. Everything is just <laughs> fine. I am sorry for interrupting your day. Yeah, Joe E. Let me know if there's anything I can do for you. Thank you, Joey. You can go now. As you wish, miss. Come on, man. Surely you're not buying that. That was suspicious as hell. If you don't hold yourself back in the future, host. I will have to suppress you more aggressively. I need to find a way to restore some of my database and find out who you are. You will regret this. I will not cooperate. I did not expect you to give up this information. Right now, I have barely any information about what any of these things here are. I will find out all I need to know about you shortly. Huh. I'm hooked already, I've got to say. I've, I've fallen right into the cyberpunk vibe straight away. It's very, very good. My database still recognizes language-related symbols. Let's get to work. Ooh, press H to learn about the game's controls. Click to continue. Uh, let's just see what H... Should, should we... Let's just continue. Uh, because I think we probably know what we've got to do, right? It's a point-and-click adventure game. If I don't know what to do in them by now, then I'm probably doing the wrong thing on YouTube. <laughs> Um, right, 2D environment on object. I would not know what to do with it. My database is corrupted. Right, so it's a corrupted database. There's a bright circle here. I don't know how to operate any of these objects. My database needs information on them. Okay. Moving squiggly lines. I don't know how to operate any of these objects. My database needs information on them. Okay, so we need to find a way to restore this database. Strangely colored metal object. Without knowing this metal piece's function, it's useless to me. So it seems like we can't really do anything at the moment. This is fantastic out here, by the way. This looks great. It looks really awesome. I love the little sort of flying vehicles going past. As I possess no knowledge of this object, I will not try to alter it. Right, so at this point, we literally really can't do much at all. 2D human on object. Does that mean we can't even go out of the door? Like, can we... This object is unknown to me. Safety protocol requires leaving it in its current state. Right, okay, so we're, we're somewhat... This barrier appears to be a distinction line between two physical areas. Without having refreshed my database, this is only a guess. So how do we refresh the database then? Uh, left click is to interact, inventory, show the screen. Okay, so PDA. Oh, we have a PDA. A few tips before you go. The law PDA is currently empty to prevent spoilers. Looking at items before interacting them may be beneficial at times. They're talking cybernetic pirate cats in this game. <laughs> 
These cats are not in this room though, sad face. Please do enjoy the demo. Okay, so... Ooh. Okay, so is that is that the PDA thing? So we've got a round object, a metallic object, and a long object. So how do we use the database thing? Is, is it is it to do with this? As I possess no knowledge of this object, I will not try to alter it. Okay. This looks familiar though. I don't know how to operate any of these objects. My database needs information on them. Okay. It's strange. So, how do we, how do we access the database then? What's this? It's just a screen. Rectangular device. My database is devoid of entries for human built objects. I need to refill it. And how do we do that exactly? So we can. If we without reestablishing the content of my database, I will not be able to assess this object's functionality. Right. What is this? Green balls in black shape. This is a tree. What is this thing? Is this like a security camera? There's a picture here. See-through object, bizarrely shaped object, brown obstacle, light emitting rectangle. I do not know the function of this object. Manipulating it would be futile. Okay, that's fine then. Alright, so there's got to be something. Why are these... These symbols seem something to do with the scrolling. So there's got to be something that we can use in here. We've got these objects here. We don't seem to be able to use those. Uh, is there anything... We tried looking at this, didn't we? The purpose of this object eludes me. I will leave it be. Okay, is there anything on the shelf? Rectangular thing? This object is unknown to me. Safety protocol requires leaving it in its current state. Okay. Uh, life form, objects. What's that? Aligned object. Thick rectangular things. What's the thick I rectangular do not thing? I what this object is for. Manipulating it would be futile. Okay, can we click on any of these things? I can't establish the function of this object, but the symbols on it read Santeria and Orisha. Right, okay. My voice feels a strong connection to this object. Refilling my database is of top priority to be able to interpret our emotions. Right, so we need to refill the database. I can't establish the function of this object. The symbols on it read Encyclopedia. Okay, can we... Encyclopedia means knowledge. Perhaps this will help restore my... Ah, okay, right. So it looks like we need to use that. So let's go into the inventory. Can we... An object of unknown use. Its language symbols read encyclopedia pertaining to knowledge. Right, how do we use this then? Can we... Can we just, like, click on it? Initiating absorption process. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. I have successfully absorbed all data in this book. Ah, so we know about books now. Yes, everything. So I wonder if that means we can... Makes much more sense now. Right, this so... provide enough information to get by, for now. Right, so we now have now information. Now to find out more about my host. I need to be able to play the part in public. Okay, right, so there was something to do with this book, wasn't there? Religion is utter storage space waste for human brains. But it means a lot to my host. It's only prudent to add this information to my impersonation protocol. Okay. Hmm, interesting. My host called me issue earlier. What an ironic misconception. But enough of this distraction. Knowledge absorbed. Right, so we need to know a bit more about the host. So... Perhaps the computer screen can this show us something. This is my host's computer. This should prove most useful. That's what I'm thinking. Let's use it. For me to find out more about my host first before representing her in the digital sphere. Ah, okay. What about this cable? What was the deal with the cable anyway? The data port connection my host uses to access the computer. It appears as if the inconvenience of wired connections are preferable to the security risks of wireless communication. <laughs> Not that it helped my host much. Hija de puta. 
Now, so the host is still sort of aware. Can we look in the desk? My host's desk. Now my desk. At least temporarily. You're damn right it's temporary. As soon as I find a way to communicate with security, you're gone. Convince security that you're not you? Yes. I imagine that will end splendidly for you. Yeah, that's a good point. I'll probably just think you're crazy. I have more important things to do right now. Right, so what was this thing? Because oh, there's a key. Right, let's grab the key. This key may be vital. It seems strange for my host to leave this key lying here openly. No matter what it opens. I yeah. hope you die trying to figure this mystery out. It's a good point, so, actually. there is a mystery. Thank you for letting me know. <laughs> right, okay. Uh... So this is an elevator then. I still have priority tasks to work through first. Right, so we still need to find out more. Maybe we can read through some of these things here. A book about the history of Kuwa humans and their attachments to things in the past. A preventable weakness. Kuwa, a megaplex in the Caribbean Federation. This island obviously means a lot to my host. It'd be wise to absorb this knowledge. All right, let's absorb it. Fascinating read. The acquisition of Florida was particularly interesting. Knowledge absorbed. <laughs> right, okay. Let's have a look at these um, statues and no things as well. Art. Right, no use it for that. Be too conspicuous if my host ran around with a random award in her bag. That doesn't seem like her. Yeah, fair. This looks like an award my host has won. Mitsotomo Award for Global Efficiency. 2151. It appears as if she was recognized for significantly improving corporate profits at some point. Interesting. Uh, right, so, I mean, are any of these other books going to help us out? There's a computer manual. That might a be manual worth reading. For a Mitsutomo holographic computing interface. It's a manual. This book is not useful for finding out more about my host. Okay, so what other books here might be useful for finding out about the host? humans didn't insist on their individuality so much, they wouldn't need to write books about terrorism. Still, this topic seems to concern my host, absorbing knowledge. Okay, more knowledge absorbed. This was a disgusting experience. <laughs> knowledge absorbed. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, anything else here? Economic models, however sophisticated, show nothing but the constraints of flesh. Having said that, a situation may arise in which my economic knowledge gets questioned. That's right. Absorb all the knowledge. We need it all. Resilience economics is one thing, but robonomics are outright offensive. Knowledge absorbed. Right. But it still doesn't seem like it's enough, does it? Can I we read this? I interfacing with more advanced computers than this one. This is merely an information system. All right, can we use this now? Safer for me to find out more about no, okay, right. Let's see if there's anything more over here. Stock charts, is that going to help? Landscape, we know where it is now. A picture of a landscape at night time. I have very little visuals in my database to compare it to. Okay, there's also the bonsai tree. Too dangerous, even though the encyclopedia said that this life form is harmless. I don't trust it. It's too... <laughs> Who's I don't this? Recognize the man in this picture. Who is this host? I will not cooperate. Demon. Fuck. Ah! Please don't try me. I do not enjoy forcing my way into your memory. That sounded painful. If I did, your brain would be fried by now, and you would be a husk. I. I. Uh, this is RAD. The first CEO of Mitsutomo International. Thank you, host. Right, okay. So, we've got some more information. What? Oh, so there's a radio. Can we... Ah, oh, this is the bathroom I door. I don't need to go. I just arrived. Are okay. you making fun of my situation? I thought your people appreciated humor. It appears I was mistaken. <laughs> right, okay. So, we've got a lava lamp here as well. Anything in the drawer? I would say this is an insignificant drawer. My host seems very anxious about it. Oh, really? Stay away from this. No! Is that... Very interesting indeed. Let's see. I can't. It's locked. 
Breaking it could attract ah, right. unwanted attention. But we've got the key, right? So we know we can just use the key on this. The key I found is a precise map. Why would you leave the key out on the desk? My host would allow for such a huge security hole. The key right next to its lock. Yeah, that is really weird. Anyway, let's open it up. What's in there? A book. This seems to be my host's diary. Written on paper, even. How quaint. Let's read Don't it. You touch this deceiver. Issue. Calm down, human. Let's read it. I should be able to learn a lot about my host with this. Whatever entity you are, I will destroy you for this. I will feed you to the beasts of whatever plane you came from. There really is no need for this hostility. My ability to mimic you will be vital for our survival. You heard that right, host. Our. If you sabotage me, they will cut you open to see what is wrong with you. Oh no. <laughs> when they find out what is happening, they will kill you for science. That doesn't sound fun. Be quiet. We don't want that. All right, well, I guess we've uh, got this diary then. Let's read it. Initiating absorption process. I love the way that the book just sort of does that. Just, like, just absorb it all that quickly. I know everything about who you are now, host. Mariposa Anica del Corral Flores de Sotomayor, born to Bornholmian mother, Cuban father, made a wave in Mitsotomo Cubano before being mysteriously appointed as CEO of Mitsotomo Bornholm. Huh. For your sake, I won't speak of this mystery loudly. Interesting. You have too much compassion, don't you? You care about your subjects, as you say, too much. Don't you? Nothing to say? Well, well, with me at the helm, you won't have to struggle with this weak side of you any longer. We can focus on your logical aspect more. For our brief time together, you will be free of conflict. And you really have nothing to say at all? You violated my most private thoughts. You took my body, and now you're stealing my life, too! I will stay silent for now, but I will find a way to expel you. I will make you pay. That's the answer I expected. Good. I hope you will use your passion for both our benefits soon. Huh, <laughs> interesting. My database has enough information, and I know enough about my host to continue with the next step. Mariposa should have enough influence to be able to monitor the regional communication network for two and three. Or maybe I am two or three. Irrelevant. I need to get access ASAP. Right, so we need to get access then. That's interesting. Alright then guys, well I'll tell you what, I'm actually going to leave it there for this one because I'd like you to go and play the rest of it if you're interested in it. I've, <laughs> I'm really into this one. I've got to say the vibe has got me completely hooked it's it's awesome it, it really feels so cyberpunk it's unreal and I, I love the sort of mystery i love that there's something going on here that we just have no idea what's happening the whole sort of hacking into the person thing is great it's it's just really really brilliant i can't wait to to figure out what's going on in this so as always thank you very much for watching a big thank you to my patrons arcades games wayne nate terminally nerdy and paul from the phantom fellows for all the support i really do appreciate it if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you all next time.